we go out big. And I am a lightweight. On top of having anger issues, I cannot <laughs> hold my liquor. So I have two drinks, and then we start uh, doing gravity bong hits. That's when it gets good. That's when it gets good. Ari Shafir, and today all the stories are about karma. Please give it up for Mr. Al Magical, everybody. Let him hear it. A man that Hitler missed. Please help me welcome Ari Shafir. Hey, let me ask you a question. Wait, when the guy was chasing you, how did you get away? How did you climb a fence? I hopped a fence. If you ever have to hop a fence, you hop that fucking fence. Uh, it was a low, it was like that high, and I just scaled it immediately. Did you feel like a real Mexican when you were <laughs> the fence? That's fucked up. Are you gonna take that, fellas? That's fucked up. I'm enlisting all the other Mexicans here to kill the man in the denim suit. <laughs> Look, he looks like an evil ranch owner. Yeah. It's like, uh, it's like this. What time is it? Mm. Time to leave the Chavez Ravine because we're about to invite the Dodgers over here. That's totally, you're pulling an old woman out of her house so you can fucking bring the Dodgers yeah. in. Jackie Robinson, <laughs> fucking beat it. Yeah. Uh, here's the deal about how magical. We've known each other for a long time. Long time. Um, he, he's not someone to fuck with. I look like someone to fuck with. He sure does. Look at him. A lot of people fuck with me. What are you like, 5'10, five, 5'9? Five, yeah, I'm not 5'10. Yeah. Give me with the hunch about 5'8. He's got anger issues, you guys. I do. He's got serious anger issues. And uh, we all went one time to La Jolla, me, him, and Steve Renazzisi. That's what happened. So if you're a comedy store comic, you get this gig in San Diego and it's fun, so you want to go with your buddies. So I go down with Ari and Renazzisi, and we all stay at this condo together. But then I know people there, and uh, we uh, go out. We go out big. And I am a lightweight. On top of having anger issues, I cannot <laughs> hold my liquor. So I have two drinks, and then we start uh, doing gravity bong hits. That's when it gets good. That's when it gets good. We went to this backyard. Some La Jolla like, rich kids like, rented a house. They have all these fire pits, and we're just fucking smoking out of shit. We didn't even understand. <laughs> Like, put your hand here, put your other hand there, and then breathe then? in. Like, oh, right. man. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to go lay down. And I'm lying there. You should have seen how up. blasted he was. Just wasted. As drunk and fucked up as I could possibly get. So, like, ow, and ow. Then, and then like, what happened next? What happened next was, what did happen next? How did I do this exactly? I don't know, but I don't like okay, it. Okay, I had a fun thing. <laughs> where I would go to my friends and I'd learn stage slaps. And so, like, if you just slap somebody, just don't get this knuckle in, just above there. You can, here, I'll show you on a girl, so you guys don't, wait, I missed it. Well, all right, anyway, it's been a while. I tried to slap an audience member. <laughs> no you gotta treat your audience like with respect, you know? Yeah. Slap them around once in a while. Anyway, I thought it'd be funny if I did that to Madrigal. Not funny. Yeah, I was like, hey, Al, hey, Al. And then I just fucking, just. <laughs> Open hands. It wasn't really a stage slap at all. No. I mean, I tell you, it's above there, slap. I got him here and above. <laughs> it got the two parts that hurt the most. And I, uh, boom. I was a little drunk too, but I knew what I was doing. <laughs> so then we went back to the condo. And he just took it. He was like, Duh. That's how fucked up I was. But I, I'll never forget. So we went back to the condo. <laughs> And I set an alarm for 4.30 in the morning. <laughs> and I woke up and I have got two pitchers fill, filled in with ice and got ice water. And I walked over and I stood above Ari and I just poured it all over him and his sleeping bag and ruined the entire bed. Couldn't even go back to sleep after that. Like I yeah. woke up like, what the fuck? 
But oh I remember, I, 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 then I leaned over him. He's like, <gasps> <laughs> It's a pretty good already. I leaned over him. <laughs> I leaned over him and I said, never touch me again. <laughs> Crazy person. I haven't, I haven't. No, I haven't. shouldn't. No one should. How magical, everybody. Yeah.